Also, a reminder that uh, there's a drops going on or a drop going on for WoW uh, for the next couple of weeks. It looks like um, if you're interested in picking that stuff up, dun, dun, dun. all I need to do is watch a streamer who's participating in this uh, drop, this drop event, and uh, if you watch anybody who's uh, streaming the game for four hours or more. Between May 16th and May 30th, you'll pick up an Eye of the Legion pet. All you need to do is make sure that your Blizzard account is linked to your Twitch account, and you'll be good to go. And again, it doesn't have to be four consecutive hours. It just has to be four hours total over that, that time frame. And if you're wondering how many days do I stream a week of WoW, basically only two, Saturdays and Tuesdays. Um, you can check out the schedule below the video screen, and uh, that'll let you know what the times of the day that I stream on those days. And if you have any questions, ask away. In the meantime, currently flying down to Thunder Bluff and then Gadgetstan after that, and then we'll be doing some. Uh, uh, what was it? Uh, uh, some runs for Wild Offerings, because we need a minimum of 12 to get the turn in for that. And uh, that's what we'll be doing. We probably won't do six runs, but we'll see. We'll see how many we can get in before it goes, stop! This is too much. <laughs> so. And still no news for the next, uh, phase of Season of Discovery, probably because Cataclysm just did come out last weekend, so they'll probably be switching over soon. And also, if you didn't hear, um, there are some of the, the classic servers, not the Season of Discovery servers, but the regular cla WoW classic servers are being uh, shut down or merged with other servers. Um, I don't know if there's any specific dates on that's supposed to happen. I just know that the server that I had characters on is one of the servers slated to be uh, merged. So you might want to check into that um, if you're still playing on the classic servers or have characters there you'd like to move over to a specific server because if you don't choose a server they will move you. <laughs> so there's always that. Which message mind? on that the message on that said it was going to happen sometime after the official catalog which will be next week is it week is the, the official pre launch pre next week okay yeah we've we only have the pre-patch so far okay so i think uh, before the stream when i opened the launch there was a countdown of about 50 hours for kata for the actual launch so that would be probably tuesday maybe monday 50 oh so 50 hours so 24 hours tomorrow yeah, probably probably Monday night, midnight would be my guess. Depending on where you are, be the time, of course. How, when mounted on the back of a wind rider, one sees that its reputation for strength and speed is well earned. Go in. Okay, head to the gadget stand from Thunder Bluff. Oh, and I was, like I said earlier, I checked out the the Mista Pandaria. What is it? The whatever the name of that event is. Basically, it's um, on retail. Just create a new character, and it's a time something or other character. And um, I think that idea is kind of like Season of Discovery, as far as uh, special stuff that you can get. Um, I didn't put a. Whole, I only put like. 15 20 minutes into it before I got distracted doing something else in real life, so I didn't really get a good chance to look at it. But it looked kind of interesting, I guess. <laughs> the biggest shock to me was the differences between the game engines between Classics Engine and Retails. There's some significant differences there, which would be expected, you know, 20 year old engine compared to a, probably a 10, but uh, it's still very shocking the animations and just the general textures and everything. I like how you start out with huge bags. 
I didn't even notice. I wasn't. I was it huge bags. I didn't even notice. Yeah, they're 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 like uh, I don't know twenty something slot, uh, well, 24, 20, 26, somewhere in there. Yeah, I think that's what my death knight um, cataclysm started with too. Was right somewhere around there. Yeah, I was, I was somewhat shocked at that in doing a creating a new death knight, and it was like the back space was like a kid. <laughs> I think it was like twenty something. It's very shocking, especially if you played classic anytime uh, recently it's like where you get a nice little was it 12 10 you start with a 16 and that's it yeah it's 16 and you have to get no bags right it's amazing what the difference of a couple of slots will do and they really changed uh, death knights in in pandaria the different at this I don't know if it's uh maybe it's the retail skill tree. I haven't really looked at retail um, skill trees recently, and they're very different, very very different compared to classic and cataclysm. Yeah, they're a lot bigger and have a lot more options to them. It seems like it. I think it was. It looked like the the trees were deeper, but not wider. It seemed like is because it more like a like these. You know, these are you know this is depth going up and down and then side to side. But from what I could tell, it was um, like I said, you didn't have as many choices going side to side. It was just there was more stuff going down. So. Maybe less choices from for each level, but maybe more stuff as you go through. It depends. <laughs> what do you mean by depends? Because the trees go wider and narrow per level, sort of. Well, yeah. For well, I didn't really look a whole lot at it because I didn't. Like I said, it was. If it's a level 10 character you start off with and you only get, you know, one point to choose or to start with. And for Death Knights, it was one tree, as far as I could tell. Like I said, I didn't really put a whole lot of thought into it because just goofing off. It has six There's a, a, a separate tab for selecting your specialization. When I brought up N, it was um, it's a Death Knight and then it was Frost on the same screen. I yeah, it, the, the Death Knight will be full of Frost when you do the Bonk remix. Yeah. But uh, if you look at the bottom of the window, there's a freaking tab. Click on that, you can change your specialization. Ah, okay. Something to consider. Some rows, they have six options, but on others, you'd have two. Well, they're probably key choice or key levels like they do in and even here, I mean, look, you only have two choices, and even so. I think with the, for level 10, it was uh, on just basic Death Knight stuff, it was, I think, three wide. Because I didn't, I didn't really, I didn't look at it too much. Except have three tiers, so you need... 20 points on the first tier to be able to access stuff below that tier, then you need 48 points on that tier. Yeah, so it's basically, it's the same system as Classic, it's just slightly different. Or different point requirements. Because that's, that's how these all work. You know, you can't sec take the second row until you take so many points on the first row. Same general idea.
Yeah, it's. I didn't. Well, I didn't say it was the same. It's just that it was similar. <laughs> Am I the first one here for a change? Or are you guys already inside? See you guys on the map. Step in and find out. So I wasn't the first one here because that stupid long ass flight. But it was free, mostly. Well, mostly free. Punch in any way you want each tier as long as you can't connect your talent nodes. Oh well, yeah, and again, that's how that works here too. Spend five points on the first row to get to the second row. Well, that's actually how it is here too. Well, unless you're trying to unlock something in the next tier. Then you have to. Some things are, you know, specific. If they're, you know, chained together. But some of them are. you get two talent trees at the same time in mob retail. Did you? I didn't. I know it was the class one, and I didn't really, like I said, I didn't really check it out. Now. I don't think this thing likes us. We look like idiots, you know. Oh, gotta go to the low side. Okay, look, I can hear you. Okay, screw this. It's faster just to kill stuff. I've never done that. I've only I've never done that even today. <laughs> that means I did it earlier today, by the way. I was talking to myself going, hmm, why is nobody responding to me? Oh, the mute button's on still. I do that at least once a stream, by the way. Ten, you only get a point for your class talent. Eleven, you'll get a point for your spec. Okay, like I said, not, not a huge deal.
sands consume you. friend. Is that how to treat a friend? Well, it's an uninvited friend, so yes. behind you. Say that like it's a bad thing. I don't think we have to uh, summon the Hydra. We will get the, the next male armor. <laughs> and I think if she drops the, do the dagger, no one wants to take that. Needs a bigger item list.
Oops. Oops. Is that all you can say? That was really poorly done. It was. I almost forgot to loot the spider. This game hates me. She's, she's very supportive, Jeff. She works for free. Doesn't get much more supportive than that. And I met a friend. She could be friendlier with their support. It's okay. I'm used to dealing with rockets, so... Somebody's shooting somebody. Oh, another troll. Less than free. You can't really do that, can you? She would have to pay me, I think. Oh, I didn't make it. <laughs> oh, damn it. Ah, screw it. Oh. Oh, her kids making friends. All kinds of friends. Some of them were my friends. Oh. Hey, me cat, welcome back. Uh -huh. He's making friends. Is he sewing the body parts together properly? I don't know. He's not a he's not a warlock or a necromancer, so probably not. He's a shaman, though, so he might be. Run for it. Shit. Ta da. So that's one. Okay, so it's, uh. You said all instances. Done.
Oops. <laughs> He's gonna have to attack him anyway. Closer than I was. My hill. Nobody can have my hill. I did not aggravate those bugs. Just want to point that out. That was not me. Copy my lightning shield.
Mm -hmm. Close to beating this game. Uh, yeah, any second now. Any second now. What happens once you beat it? Well, start the universe implodes. You can't see your credit card and hope for the best. the undead come from? One of the totems. Oh. It's another spider.
Storm Stretch. Will I get mobbed again? Probably. Oh, wow. <laughs> they didn't actually... Oh, too yeah. sure. Yeah. <laughs> I'm good. They can't get through my awesome moonkin armor. What is my armor anyway? 45, 45, 4551 is a moonkin. That's not too bad. That a PvP can? What? What's a PvP thing? Okay, it's reset. Did he break or one more oh. and break? Um hmm, how long's it taking us? I was I haven't been paying attention. That last one to attack me. Oh no, they're just NPCs in the dungeon. That around fifteen minutes, my food is about to run out. Okay, so I'm take a break then. Be easier that way. Okay, so this will be the last break of the stream, as Veronica will say when I get back in about... She'll say it in about 10 minutes or so, but we're going to take a break for about 3 to 5 minutes. Get up, stretch your legs, get some water, that kind of thing. Thank you all very much for watching. Of course, thank you, AOLS, Hurricane, and Ragstone for joining me again. So, that's it. So, be back shortly. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the dog video.